Hey Speaking Stars, Verity Robbins here from The Speaker, Speak and Grow Rich and I wanted to wish you a Merry Christmas as well as give you some tips for delivering a Christmas toast that really rocks. So I've got four points that I'm going to cover to help you deliver the best Christmas toast of your life. The first point is be succinct. Keep it short. A short toast is a great toast. Waffling and going off into long stories about your past or whatever it might be, it really doesn't work. And especially not at Christmas if people had a few drinks or if you're at a work party. If you're presented to clients, you definitely want to be succinct. And if people are holding their arms up ready to toast, then oh my gosh, you need to make it really about 20-30 seconds long. Really short and snappy. Otherwise, a minute, two minutes tops is a great way to go. So tip one, keep it short. Tip two, remain positive. Be po now is at Christmas when you've got your clients, when you've got your staff or your team, or when you've got your family around you, it's not the time to highlight all the issues, all the things that went wrong and the, the marks that you didn't hit for the year. You leave all of those behind for the moment because now's not the time and what you do is you focus on what went well, the successes, the money you made, the, the way that you worked as a team. So the second tip is remain positive. Tip three is make sure that you thank everyone. And this is really important. If you are going to thank specific people, be damn darn sure that you've actually got everyone and you're going to thank them all. And the fourth tip for delivering a Christmas toast that rocks is to make sure that you finish on a high so that you, you celebrate the year, you've thanked people, you've talked about the positive things and you finish on a high. So the only time that you would refer to anything negative is by saying something like, and, and you know, we, we lost that contract early in the year but what I loved about that is how we all pulled together and we have made this year so successful despite the setbacks. So you might refer to a negative only in the way of leaving it as a positive. So you're going to finish everyone talking about what you hope for next year, how, how happy you are with your family, with your loved ones or with your team, with your clients, how happy you are with them, how much you look forward to going into the future. So there are the four tips for delivering a Christmas toast that rocks. Be succinct, be positive, Make sure you thank everyone and finish on a high. I'd love, love to wish you a Merry Christmas. I've had such a great time working with so many of you this year and I really look forward to next year, to 2014, to setting goals that mean that our communications, my communications, are setting goals for you that mean that your communication skills will get you more clients, will mean bigger, better conversions, more conversions and ultimately more money. I look forward to seeing you speak with power and confidence. It really rocks. <laughs> so I've got a few points and the first for delivery. Um, I'm melting with some water, oh my gosh.